What's up guys, I'm Tiger with Tiger Upcoming Media back with another Dokkan battle video. So I know this is a little bit late and there are already tons of other videos out there about this very topic, but I'm still getting questions from subscribers asking me how to get the five star ball or the three star ball or whichever cracked Dragon Ball they're missing. So I thought instead of answering every single one of these questions individually, I might as well make a video with all the information you guys need in one place. So without further ado, Let's jump right into it. As you can see, we're on my main JP account where I have already collected all seven cracked Dragon Balls. But that's cool because I can still explain everything to you guys verbally. I also want to give a huge shout out to Goresh on the Dokkan subreddit for providing the translations for every single one of the clues. Now, unlike the past Dragon Ball collecting missions where you're collecting all seven balls in order from one star to seven star, we're actually collecting them out of order this time, starting with the six star Dragon Ball. So for this one, the clue is clear stage one while supporting allies with a lewd pig. So the lewd pig, of course, is referring to Oolong. And originally I thought that I meant that you have to use a Oolong support item while fighting the boss for stage one. But all you have to do actually is obtain a Oolong support item while on the stage and you should be able to get that six star Dragon Ball. So. That's a six star, that's the first one for stage one. Moving on to stage two. For stage two, you're actually looking at the two star Dragon Ball. And for the two star Dragon Ball, you have to obtain the strange water that amplifies your power many fold. And this is referring to the sacred water training item. So if you collect a sacred water training item on stage two, you'll get the two star Dragon Ball. Moving on to stage three now. For stage three, we're collecting the four star Dragon Ball. So it says clear stage three together with an ally who moves well, learns well, plays well, eats well, and rests well. It's a saying that's often used by Master Roshi. So basically what this is referring to is the turtle school link. So you have to clear stage three with a unit that has the turtle school link. Now I'm pretty sure one unit is enough, but just to be safe, maybe bring two or three. And once you use those units to clear the stage, you should be able to get the four star Dragon Ball. Okay, next up is stage four, obviously. Stage four, we're looking at the five star Dragon Ball now. And it says, clear stage four together with the pure one of the warrior race. So just bring a unit from the pure Saiyans category on your team while running the stage, and you'll be able to get the five star Dragon Ball. Okay, moving on, we have stage five. And for stage five, we're actually looking at the one star Dragon Ball. It says clear stage five together with the legendary warrior who strikes fear into even Frieza. Now this clue is referring to the Super Saiyan Link. So you wanna bring at least one, possibly a few units with the Super Saiyan Link on your team for stage five. And you'll get the one star Dragon Ball. So we got two more now, stage six. For stage six, you're collecting the seven star Dragon Ball. So clear stage six together with a bunch of warriors, of super warriors of one color. So basically it wants you to bring a super motto team. All super units of the same type. It can be whichever type you want, super AGL, super tech, super int, super phys, whatever. Bring those on this stage and you'll be good to go for this Dragon Ball. And last but not least, we have stage seven and we're collecting the three star Dragon Ball on this stage. The clue is, Clear stage seven together with an ally who played a role in the Majin Buu saga. I think it's pretty self-explanatory. Essentially, just bring a Majin Buu saga category unit, or maybe a few just to be safe, onto this stage, and you'll get the three-star Dragon Ball. So there you go, guys. That is all seven of the cracked Dragon Balls for the four-year anniversary event. What's gonna happen is, once you collect all seven, you'll summon the Smoke Black Shenron, and you'll be able to unlock a new like boss rush style uh, shadow dragon stage. Beat that and you'll get extreme Z battle for Omega Shenron where you can get the new int spirit bomb Goku and a bunch of Kai's orbs, all that good stuff. So that's it guys. Hope you guys found the video useful. If you had some trouble understanding my clues or something's not working for you, then just leave a comment in the comment section down below and I'll try my best to help you out. But otherwise, if you guys like the video, then make sure to like, the damn video and if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel you like what you see then make sure to hit that big red subscribe button to join the tiger squad now and while you're at it hit that notification bell too so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all of my latest content but that's it that's all for me today hope you guys have a fantastic day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out